This was the first week of the 2014 Georgia General Assembly. In your state senate, we passed legislation to adjust the 2014 election dates to be in compliance with an order by a federal judge to help our active duty military have their votes counted in an appropriate manner. Governor Nathan Deal gave three major speeches, with the centerpiece being his State of the State Address. The governor outlined his legislative agenda, which includes increased resources for our teachers and students, as well as ensuring we move forward with the expansion of the Port of Savannah, which is without question the single most important economic development project in our state. I was pleased to offer remarks in my capacity as Senate co-chair of the Diabetes Caucus. Dozens of Georgians gathered at our state capitol to raise awareness of the deadly consequences of diabetes and fight for those affected by that disease. Let me share a few of the facts of the successes we have had in Georgia as I have worked with Governor Deal and my colleagues in the Georgia General Assembly. We've created 217,000 new private sector jobs, and Georgia was recently named the number one state in the nation in which to do business. And the Tax Foundation named Georgia as the state with the lowest tax burden on its citizens. As always, contact me at, judge, at Judson at JudsonHill.com, and please stay in touch by Facebook and Twitter. Thanks.